Hello guys and welcome to a different Russia channel. Some time ago our friend bought a flat. In Russian it is Quartira Studia. The kitchen is combined with the living room. There is no wall between the kitchen and the living room. So he made some renovations some time ago. Uh, to tell you honestly, they are not finished yet. Uh, but he invited us uh, to have a look at his new flat. So right now we are going there. The review of this flat will be in some other video, but right now I want to answer a very popular question. A lot of people ask this question on my channel. The question is the following. How much is to rent a flat in Russia? So guys, first of all, I, I should say that if you ask such question, so uh, just imagine uh, if someone asks you such a question. So how much is it to rent a flat in your country? It is impossible to answer this question because, uh, well, it is a very general question. How many rooms you need? in what city or town or village this flat is situated. So if the flat is in Moscow, so it will be one price. If it is somewhere very far from a big city in some small village, for example, so that will be another price. How many people are going to live in that flat? So you are going to live alone or you are going to live with other people? For what period you are going to rent this flat? So if you would like to rent for just uh, one month or two months, that will be a rather high price. So if that will be a long period, for example, one year, it will be another price. Are you going to rent a flat with furniture or that will be empty flat? So all these facts influence the price. No one will tell you how much it will be unless you give some extra information. I have already told you about the websites. Uh, unfortunately, <laughs> many websites that we have here in Russia, they are on the Russian language. Uh, the good news is uh, that the situation is changing very slowly, but it is changing. So some websites, especially big websites, they may be on several languages, English, French, German. So, but usually, the sites are on the Russian language. The list of websites you may find in the description under this video, but I should tell you that if you want to save money on renting a flat, you should learn to find information yourself. In fact, it doesn't matter what are you looking for, you would like to rent a flat or you would like to go on vacations to some distant country or you would like to book a hotel. So it doesn't matter what you are going to rent. So you must learn how to find information yourself because otherwise you must pay to some other people if you would like them to help you. So this may be some agency or some uh, manager, it doesn't matter. Uh, but there are only two solutions, whether you do all the work yourself or you pay to someone and that person does the work for you. I have already told you that I am not the real estate agent. I do not help to find flats or rooms. Just some general information for you. To rent a two-room flat in Moscow region about 20 kilometers from Moscow will be about 20,000 rubles. As for Moscow, for this money you may rent only one room flat. And that flat will be somewhere in the suburbs of Moscow, very close to Mkhat. Also, the price depends on the distance from metro stations. So if uh, from the nearest metro station you should take a bus, so the price will be rather low in comparison with the flat that is about 10 minutes on foot from the metro station. If you would like to rent a modern flat, a flat that is very close to a metro station, the price will be about 40,000 rubles. And in the next episode, I will show you 
what you can get for this money so guys thank you for watching if you have any questions uh, you are welcome to ask them in comments subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet follow me on patreon if you would like to support the project thank you for watching goodbye see you soon in the next episode пока